In this video, I'll show you how to clear your TikTok cache and free up some space on your phone. So the TikTok app by itself takes about 300 megabytes of storage space, but this builds up quickly by other files created by the app, including cache, watch history, downloads, and drafts. So a lot of people on social media has made a comment about this and has complained that how much space TikTok has taken. So to find this out, you can go into your settings, general, iPhone storage, find TikTok. And as you can see, TikTok is currently taking up two gig of space on my iPhone. Now let me show you how to make some space on your iPhone from your TikTok app. So first you wanna go ahead and open up your TikTok app. Next, you're gonna go into profile. Here, you wanna go ahead and find any drafts which you have on your profile page. So drafts are basically videos which you've recorded and you're waiting for it to upload or you just want to keep it for memories. So you wanna go through your drafts and delete any of them manually. Now, once you've done that, you'll be able to create some space. Now, if you don't have any drafts, there is a second way to clear the space, which is by clearing the cache. So to do this, you wanna first go ahead and open up your TikTok app, go to profile, at the top right, tap on the three lines, then tap on settings and privacy. Here, you're scrolling down until you see free up space, which is in cache and cellular, tap on it. And as you can see, it shows you your cache is taking up 58 megabytes, while your download is taking you 264 megabytes. So you can go ahead and clear both of them to make some space on your iPhone. Now, once that's done, you can go back to your TikTok app, close it, go to your iPhone settings, and here you'll be able to confirm how much space your TikTok app is taking now. And as you can see, it has been reduced from two gig to 1.47 gig. So there you go, that is how to clear your TikTok cache and free up some space on your iPhone. Now, if you're new on the channel and you want to find out more about your iPhone, your Android phone, or any other social media apps, then don't forget to subscribe to this channel, hit the like button if you find this video useful. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.